Hey guys, Luke here, and welcome back to episode 6 of my New Zealand Warriors career, mate. This is season 3, and uh, let's get into the episode. Uh, so this is a little bit of a shorter one, as you can tell by the length at the bottom of the video. Uh, about four, four and a half minutes, I'd say. Um, we're going to be taking on the Rabbitohs, obviously, like I said. And it's going to be the only game of the episode. That's due to there being a buy for the second half. And also, I did forget to take a look at the, at the ladder, so uh, it's not really a problem. We're, we're on top by a mile at this stage. Uh, now, I think the buy is actually coming at a good time for us. Uh, we started off red hot, like real red hot. Sort of slowed down a little bit, getting into some grinding games. Uh, I don't know if that's a sign of our players being a little bit more fatigued or what's going on, but, you know, just gets us uh, a little bit closer. Uh, but we do have to get through the, uh, the Rabbitohs before that. Uh, I should have mentioned, I can't remember if we dropped Harold last week, uh, sorry, last episode or this episode, but uh, Peyru is in the side right now. You can see him there. Uh, in Harrell's position. No injury to Harrell. It just said that he, both Harrell and Nielsen are playing shit, which on hindsight, going back and editing these videos, doesn't really reflect it, but um, that's what the game was saying, and at the time I thought best to uh, go with what they're saying, and Pagri actually impressed me in the few games he played at the start when Nielsen was out injured. Um, but Harrell will be back in the side pretty soon. Uh, even if Pagri sets the world on fire, like Harrell is the long-term Long-term plan. I'm talking about long-term plans. I'm only like playing this season and I'm done. Uh, Rapira sitting out on the wing. They're having a bit of a bludge. Uh, but, you know, right right man at the right time, I suppose. Uh, Nielsen ended up dying with the ball there. but uh, And then Felini Mateo just got a draw and pass here, which is going to do if Adivar takes it around Goodwin or whoever it is. And then it's try time. Uh, also worth noting is um, I think there's a few duplicate players in the Rabbitohs team. I think Lafayette out there. Nathan Gardner's got a duplicate. Probably a few more that I'm missing, but just off the top of my head, those were a few. Uh, Gardner has still got another one at the Sharks, I think, and Lafayette plays for the Bulldogs as well on this. So, yeah, a little bit annoying, but uh, I remember back in my days of doing the Bulldogs, crew mode and the South and that, like, if there was duplicates, like, I think there was two Tedescos in a Super League one. So I had James Tedesco and, like, John Tedesco just, you know, just said they had the same name. Even though they played the same position, looked the same, everything. And uh, now Madalino will cross... Over, uh, we just got to take a look at the video ref just to make 100% sure here. And I'm not sure what sort of camera angle. Okay, we picked out a good camera angle in the past. Just went with whatever was before the video ref. And thankfully, we actually got a good camera angle before the video ref uh, drive came up. Now, uh, we make it 18-0. Sean Johnson kicks the guard and that's pretty much sealed it. So, uh, yeah, racing away. We've pretty much got the game wrapped up this stage. Having a bit of fun. And that's what I found was uh, the most satisfying uh, in this series this far anyways. Um... You know, we're just having, I was having a lot of fun playing this game, which is something I wasn't doing at the end. I was playing to record rather than playing to have fun. Uh, and the win one, take one series really rejuvenated me. Sean Johnson's going to put a kick through, and I think it's Mossy Masoy who ends up on the end of it. Our own duplicate. Oh, there, we have the original. Uh, so he picks up a try, and he's actually scored a fair few try for us as of, of late. Uh, and that's why he keeps remaining in the side, and uh, other people keep dropping out on the bench. Like Ben Henry, and, you know, those sort of guys. Tanner Lafayette, Lily Men, like... I don't know who to drop. Uh, I kind of feel like I should be running with two second rowers and two props, but at the same time, I got so many quality props, and I got people who can sort of just slot in everywhere. But got a larger Taylor has to slot in a hooker for parts of the game, so in a bit of a dilemma in terms of what's the best side to pick. But whatever side it is, it's a great one. Now we defended pretty darn well um, throughout here. You can see just just lots of sections where you think, oh, they're probably going to score. Like just before we gave her a high tackle in real life, would have been a sim bin. I reckon. Unfortunately, Ben Lowe's just going to cross for a consolation try. Uh, but yeah, up until that point, we defended pretty valiantly. Um, actually, I found my defending on my own line. Once I've come back and played uh, these last few ones, Warriors win my take one. Not being as strong as what I remember. Uh, I remember I used to be pretty pretty darn good at defending on my own line. Uh, fortunately for us, it doesn't really affect us too much if we continue scoring 24 points a game. Don't have to worry about defending. Uh, but that's where the video is pretty much going to end. Take a look at the the round 9 uh, results and that sort of stuff. And then we'll take a look at the round 10 results as well. Uh, not really important to me. But, you know, if you want to see where your team is, Bulldogs picking up a win. Uh, also gives me time to say thank you for watching. Hopefully you have enjoyed it. Uh, if, if you have, leave 20 uh, likes. It would be very much appreciated. That's the goal. And uh, if you could subscribe to the channel, that would be also very much appreciated. I'll reply in the comments if you've got any comments. Uh, if you want to follow me on Twitter, at MrLukeMYT. It's my Twitter handle, and my Facebook page is in the description below if you'd prefer to use Facebook. And uh, yeah, I'll see you for the next video. Bye, guys.